All right, hey, good morning, guys. I'm just sitting in the parking lot ready to go to this meeting. And um, I wanted to talk about reconciliation real quick. And I want to talk about Romans chapter 5, verse 10. I don't know the entire verse by heart, but I wanted to quote a little bit of it. And I wanted to tell you guys that I had a, a great uh, conversation with a sister in Christ yesterday. We just went back and forth a little bit on one of my videos on YouTube. And, um, you know, it's awesome to have others out there that actually believe what took place on the cross because it is very few and far in between that actually do believe the gospel. Oh, there's plenty that claim they believe the gospel, but when it comes down to it, and they're preaching a limited forgiveness gospel. They're preaching that you have to do something in order to get complete forgiveness. Then um, that is, you're no different than any of these denominations. And so I'm going to go ahead and uh, I'm going to go ahead and quote what I know. I, I don't I don't have my Bible in front of me. I've I've got the phone, but I don't I don't know the entire verse by heart. But I do know that it says, for if when we were enemies, we were reconciled to God by the death of his son. And then I believe the rest of the verse says uh, something to the effect of uh, something about much more then being reconciled we shall be saved by his life something's to that effect i don't i don't i don't want to quote i don't say that you know i'm not going to claim that to be the truth i'm just uh like i said i don't i don't i don't have the bible in front of me but um but that clearly states that when we were enemies we were reconciled to god by the death of his son it doesn't say that we were reconciled to god the moment we believe the gospel it doesn't say that that Christ died for our sins if we believe that Christ died for our sins. No, it doesn't say that. Just believe what the Bible says. Stop trying to insert your man-made doctrine into it and just believe what it says. So, um, yeah, that's all, that's all I wanted to say today, guys. And um, I just, I wish more of you out here would just believe the black words on the white pages of the King James Bible. And I know I say that a lot, but it's 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 sad that I have to mention that a lot because the sad truth is people don't. Um, okay, well, grace and peace to you guys. Have a wonderful day.